So I knew today was coming. I pretty much snipe all the time in the auction house in NBA 2K17. And I knew it was just a matter of time before I found myself in the top 5 fails of the week. Not only did I miss one snipe, but I ended up missing two ruby snipes this week. It was bound to happen, but I don't even care, man. I ended up pulling so many rubies these past couple days. Make sure to check out the previous video. I ended up pulling three ruby curries, so go check that out. But without further ado, let's make it do what it do with the top five fails of this week. And to start us off, we got ourselves Iggy Sapphire for 4k. This guy is still going for 25k in the auction house. Sapphire snipes end up going down in price, but there are still some hidden gems like this one. But unfortunately, he wasn't fast enough to get this Sapphire Iggy for 4k MT. And next up, we got ourselves Mikey missing an Anthony Davis for 2.4k. Anthony Davis is still going for a good solid 25k in the market. And it really sucks for Mikey because he used to be a really good sniper last year in NBA 2K16. But this year, man, it's a whole different game and he took another L with Anthony Davis. And at number 3, we got ourselves Westbrook for 500 MT. Now, it looks like this guy was going for the Thunder players, which, by the way, is a really good snipe filter. And he ended up seeing a Westbrook, but wasn't fast enough to get him for 500 MT. But it's all good. He's still using a really good filter, and hopefully next time, you don't miss any more snipes. And next up, we got ourselves yours truly. I ended up missing this Cheeks for like 21k. Now this card is still going for about 80 to 90k right now in the auction house. I pretty much missed it because of the Hamilton. It got in my way and I just wasn't fast enough to get the Cheeks. But like I said earlier, I'm sniping pretty much throughout the stream and sometimes I do take L's and this is one of them. And just when you thought it couldn't get any worse, I ended up missing Ray Allen for 100 KMT. Now, I was really fast on this one. I would have gotten it, but unfortunately, I only had 90 KMT. And the stream didn't have enough time to let me know that I only had 90 KMT. Right before the refresh, I had to pay someone 10 KMT for winning a giveaway in my stream. And then, of course, oh, Ray Allen had to pop up for 100 K. But it's all good. I'll take my L's for this week. But there you guys have it. If you enjoyed the video, make sure to smash the like button for me. Subscribe to Join Squad XC. And as always, Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.